Hey guys, Andrew Tran here with the Airbark Outdoors channel. And in this video, I wanted to do an overview of the Simple Strap. The Simple Strap is a new product to hit the market and it's really changed the way I've started hauling things both for work and for recreation. There's no moving parts and it's cut to length so you can use it as a whole or you can use it in shorter sections. The straps are made out of thermoplastic elastomer. It's the same stuff they make cape or handles out of. These straps contain no metal parts, unlike ratchet straps which inevitably rust and require maintenance. No metal parts also means that they don't scratch or damage your cargo. And unlike bungee cords, there's no death hooks that are going to catch your eyeballs. Normal straps rely purely on tension to secure your load, which can damage items such as gutters and flashing. Simple straps utilize a rubber-like texture for friction in conjunction with tension to secure your load, and the bearing surface can be spread over a much greater surface area to help protect your cargo as well. The material doesn't mark, which allows me to transport things like white trim. To use the straps, you'll start by overlapping on itself one time, which locks it into place. From there, you wrap it as you see fit to secure your load, and you finish by tucking the tail under itself. You can also use the simple straps to help complete repairs, like this broken dowel, to apply even tension while the glue dries. The great thing about these straps is the glue doesn't seem to want to stick to it either, so you can keep on using the strap over and over again. Since the strap is gentle on finishes, I could use it to repair this coffee table without having to use any padding to protect it. Because these straps have a rubber-like consistency, it's always wanted to constrict back to its original size. So unlike mechanical means like a ratchet strap, it's always gonna have tension. Take for example, you're on a dirt road and you have a, a load that you're hauling and you have some padding around it. Well, with uh, mechanical straps, a lot of times what I've had is uh, under all that vibration while you're transporting the object, it'll loosen up and kind of settle on itself. And then all of a sudden it becomes loose. If you're unaware of this, your load could come undone and get damaged in transport. I've also found that wrapping tools like an axe can give you temporary protection from impacts and sap from trees. This is a great way to protect your investment from new users from overswinging their target. So that is it for the simple strap. Is it gonna take care of every single instance that you're gonna run across? Maybe, maybe not. The big thing that I can think about is spanning distances. So take for example, large pieces of furniture. That's where mechanical ratchet straps or uh, a good length of rope is really gonna do you good. But for pretty much everything else, this is a really good way to secure your payload. If you guys have any comments or questions, you can go ahead and message me directly or comment down below. If you guys enjoyed the video, please like, share, and subscribe, and also check out my Facebook page, Instagram, and other social media. It really helps me know these are the kind of videos you want to see. But as always, take care out there. Bye.